Hey everybody, so I'm doing the um, rice challenge on my hair and because I have like really short hair. Let me just show you. It's like right now I have it under the plastic cap and um, I have a plastic bag right here. And I just put the rice water on yesterday and I put an orange, I mean, I'm sorry, a grapefruit inside of it. And it's been fermenting for more than 10 days at the Hangul Village people. I'm doing like theirs without a, I don't have a Carmelo because it's not Carmelo season until October. And I was like, I did not know that, you know. So I just want to encourage you to follow the rules of the, the Hangul because your hair would grow significantly if you follow the rules. It's, um, it's actually every three to four days that you apply it right now. This is the second day. I applied it yesterday because I applied it yesterday. And I applied the, um, I applied the rice water with the grapefruit in my hair. And I incubated it all night long. You're supposed to rinse it out actually, but I decided to leave it in because it makes my hair strong because my hair is quite short. And then you saw my other videos, you know. And then I'm using um, olive oil, coconut oil, and um, grapefruit inside of it as a um, leave-in conditioner for my hair for the next few days. And then until, until I get Saturday, so Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Yeah, then Sunday I'm put I'm gonna do the rice water again, put in my hair and um, incubate it again. But once again you're supposed to rinse it out. Leave it in twenty minutes, rinse it out. That's what I said. And the water is actually supposed to ferment for ten days, not one day. If you do it every day, your hair's gonna protein overload. It's gonna happen, it's not gonna grow hardly any because I see people who do it every single day, their hair doesn't grow that much because they protein overload. Don't do it every single day. So I encourage you, do not do it every single day. <laughs> you have a protein overload. You're like, it's not working. This is your protein overload. Okay, so don't do that. Every three to four days, it will grow. But, you know, you can incubate your hair. Not what I'm doing. Because my hair is growing significantly. I'll show you some other videos. It's growing, like, significantly. I got a nice little afro here. It's only been about a month, actually. So it's grown a lot. It's grown, I don't know, but I had to braid it up. So protective styling does help the hair. Just don't have it too tight um, as you're using the rest of the treatment but every three to four days and then use coconut oil and olive oil I think it's like don't use egg because egg is protein too so probably cooking oil, olive oil or peppermint oil or jojoba oil you know some kind of oil and um, or one of those hair lotions and on the braids if you have braids I recommend getting like some non tight braids not tight just very loose braids and let your hair stay in that motion. But when you have short hair like me, you want it to grow. <laughs> okay, all right, God bless, love ya. I'm, I'll show you how long my hair is, because it's like right here. I'll tell you right now, it's like right here. Originally, it was like this big. <laughs> so it's going like this big in one month. But you gotta do it right, guys, okay? God bless you, love ya.